Ohio must recognize same-sex marriages from other states. Federal Judge Timothy Black announcing that ruling today, saying that Ohio's recognition ban was unconstitutional. The case was brought to the court by several same-sex couples wanting both parents listed on birth certificates. Ohio will appeal the ruling, arguing the state has a right to determine its own marriage laws. The LGBT community in the meantime celebrating its first major legal victory in Ohio. Fox 28 reporter Ben Garbrick joins us now live with reaction to the ruling and what's next. Ben? Well, Bob, this is the ruling many people have been waiting for. Many people in the LGBT community say this is a good first step, but it's just the first step. History's changing, and I think people are going to start, you know, realizing that it's not shameful anymore. It only seems appropriate for the celebration to be at Union Cafe in the short north. Josh and Stephen Schneider Hill have been waiting for their union in Washington, D.C. to be recognized in their home state of Ohio. And our marriage is valid. It's valid in our hearts. It's valid in Washington, D.C. It's valid to the military. Even the military in Ohio, but it's not valid to Ohio, and something's wrong with that. The judge's ruling is on hold to give the state time to appeal, but for many, it was reason to celebrate. It makes sense. It's what's right. It's where the country's going. Carla Rothen works for Stonewall Columbus. She says this is the first legal step toward full marriage equality for the LGBT community. It's a matter of time. It's like a snowball, a domino effect, call it what you will. But over time, state by state, very uh, rapidly now, I hope, we will be seeing marriage equality in every single state in the union. That day isn't here yet, but many here hope it's coming soon. It means a lot to be married in Ohio, and we will get married in Ohio for our friends and family. And there are two campaigns going on right now for gay rights. One is for legislation that would make it illegal to discriminate against someone for being gay. The other is for marriage equality. But another ruling much like this could make gay marriage a reality here in Ohio before either one of those campaigns is over. Live downtown, I'm Ben Garber, Fox 28.